So in this video, we're going to talk about why diabetics must understand insulin. This is very, very, very important. It's vital. If you're diabetic, type 1 or type 2, this video is vital, okay? Especially if you don't understand insulin. Here's what you need to know. Insulin lowers blood glucose or blood sugar, okay? We'll just call it blood sugar to make it simple. So when you're taking the medication insulin, it's lowering your blood sugars, okay? Now, if your blood sugars are 100 or less and you take insulin, what do you think is going to happen? If you don't know that answer, um, you're in some serious trouble because if you take it when it's low, you're going to end up with hypoglycemia, a much lowered blood sugar to the point where you become literally stupid. I'm not trying to say you're stupid. I'm just saying you're going to be like less aware of things. You're going to do things you're, you don't understand. You're going to be uh, very like un almost slightly unconscious, okay? Because the lower the blood sugar, the more unconscious you go, even to a coma. So you'll like just walk around like, okay, forgetful, that type of thing. So we want to avoid that. And the way you avoid that is keep your blood sugars normal, okay? So if you were to do a diet or a, or a ketogenic plan or intermittent fasting, that's going to naturally lower your blood sugars and the need for insulin is going to go down. And if you continue to take insulin without understanding what's going on and you let your blood sugars drop down too low, it can be very, very, very dangerous, okay? So why does insulin lower blood sugar? Because too much sugar in the body is toxic. So your body's trying to get rid of it. So the real bigger uh, plan for this is to get the sugar out of your diet and don't eat so frequently. It's the frequency of eating and the amount of carbohydrate in your diet that's keeping you on the insulin in the first place. So if we decrease that, the need for insulin goes down, the blood sugars get better, and you can make adjustments with the help of your doctor. But what you need to understand above all else is that insulin lowers blood sugars. And as you're monitoring your blood sugars, if they come down and you take insulin, you're going to actually allow yourself to get into a real bad place. So check with your doctor, decrease the insulin as needed if your blood sugars come down. And if you're new to this, click the link down below because I have a little mini course on what to eat so you can decrease the need for insulin because taking so much insulin over a long period of time is also dangerous to the body. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, I want to introduce you to my new Dr. Berg app. It's right here. It's, I'm really excited about it. You need to download it. It's free. It has a lot of great data. It has all my videos. It's updated on a regular basis. I also have the audio version of the videos, audio episodes. I also have a mini course that you can take. I also have a button for new content so you can really know of all the, the recent content that I'm downloading. And I also have something called PDF resources, which gives you additional cool little one page uh, PDF documents on all sorts of health things. So download it, check it out and tell me what you think about it. And don't forget to give me a review. It's Dr. Berg app.